What up channel, it's 4Play, and this is just an introduction video into what I wanted to talk about. Um, this gameplay is actually from a Game Battles match with myself, Proofy, Twiz, and Hysteria. We've been playing Game Battles matches a little bit more lately, actually. We're 55-3, and three, and we're trying to push up the ladder, uh, just because a lot of people don't understand what I'm about for my team. I play Game Battles matches not to get better. Um, I, I play for my team that I created for MBS, just because I want to like cement our legacy in... Uh, in competitive gaming when I do retire, which is not for a while, hopefully, <laughs> but basically a uh, game battles matches uh, for COD 4, we ended up going 1400 wins and 150 losses, I think. And then for MW2, I wanted a goal of 500 wins because we were playing so much uh, like PCL matches and stuff like that. And then for Black Ops, I think we had a goal of 500 wins as well. And then for this game, we're going to push for 500 wins. Right now we're 55 and 3. Uh, one of the losses they had was without me, but it's no big deal. Uh, the other two losses, we actually choked two searches, uh, three v four, or it was a it was a three four loss on both of them. So I might upload some of our losses, explain what happened. Um, I know that I failed a one v four clutch in one of them, and I could have won us around. I actually I killed three of them, and then I died on the third or on the fourth. I'm sorry, and that that kind of sucked, but it is what it is. So um, as you're gonna see in a lot of these games and stuff. I'm getting back into competitive gaming. It's something that I miss so much, and it's good to finally like hit it again. You know, like it, it's good to try to dominate kids and try to, I don't know, just do my play style. I think a lot of competitive gamers have completely different play styles, and that's why I think a lot of you guys like have your favorite YouTubers and you have your favorite pros and stuff because you can you can relate to how they play. Uh, like the Slayers relate to the Slayers, support players, and and so on. But in this next round, I want you to see when this third round starts up, this might be one of the fastest rounds um, for competitive S&D, for competitive search and destroy. I'm going to start this out, and I, I do this, this rush up the middle sometimes a lot faster than others. If I don't stun check the left, which I suggest that all teams do on search and destroy, I'm going to push quick and have somebody else stun check my left, and I'm going to try to do quick stuns out. In fact, I threw the, those stuns so fast, I didn't even have a chance to get out yet. But I'm going to pick up one and two and then immediately turn left for the three because I knew he'd be waiting. I got real hungry for the fourth kill. Twiz was shooting at him too, but I ended up stealing it. So that was four quick kills in that round. Um, yeah, that rush is definitely good if you guys want to try it. But back to what I was talking about. This is basically just an introduction into telling you guys that I want to upload like commentaries uh, on the daily. And if not every day of the week, at least four. Because I know you guys know I have so many other series going on with the breakdowns and the pro scenes and the and the, all that stuff. And I'm going to start doing vlogs with the Fitness Friday because I know a lot of people wanted to see that. And that's going to be awesome. So, But anyway, I wanted to come on here and just talk to you guys basically because I don't get a chance to do that. Everything is all breakdown related and all that. And I want to be able to get on here and talk to you guys but also continue to do the other stuff. Like, I don't want to be like one of the commentators that just talks over gameplay because I do think that's so oversaturated and pointless. I'm going to continue doing the montages and stuff as well. But I want my channel, like, my goals for this channel is to be the central hub for, like, competitive gaming. Like, I have so much fan support from you guys, which is awesome. And then I just want to keep growing in a sense of letting people know that, like, especially for Black Ops 2. When that game drops, I want to be putting out so much content to help you guys get better because I just want to raise the standard in competitive gaming. And by raising the standard, I mean not like, hey, I'm the greatest, I'm the best, etc., like bragging about it, but I, I mean like getting other players good to where they're confident enough to come out to those LAN events or to get on game battles and start gaming and stuff. It's all about raising the awareness for esports. Oh, this is another clutch right here. Um... How basic was this clutch? I don't think he was expecting me to push up, and I almost choked the, the kill. But either way, I, I did pretty good in this game. I think I did like 8-1 and one or something like that, but I'm going to continue posting my matches. This is basically just an introduction. For these, I'm just going to put the like the title of the commentary up top, and then that's about it. So this is 4Play of Team Envious. Peace.